Welcome to today's edition of Purification of the Day. Today's purification is Mistrevis. Mistrevis is the only ghost type Pokemon in this entire game, but still isn't that useful. Regain Psybeam, making it a bit more useful. Got a ribbon. Mistrevis' nickname will be Grossed. We now return you to your regularly scheduled program. There it is. The Jigglypuff of Legend! No, I was actually referring to the giant beautiful stadium in front of us. I was not referring to this pink sweater singer thing. Hello and welcome back to another Splendid Never episode of Pokemon Coliseum. In the last episode, we discovered a lot of expositionary stuff about Cypher and what, like, there's a lab somewhere and also we got an elevator key and they apprehended that there was a lot happening. You should go watch it. But also Adele challenged us. Um, I don't know if that's a that's a thing. We, we sung off. It was a sing off and I won. So I am a golden voiced angel. No, I am not. Okay. Entering the FedEx Stadium. That is what the whole goal of this episode is. What's up, girl? What's up, girl? You like to go for a swim? Let's go for a swim. Shut up, Yuki. Okay. So what's up? Hello, welcome to Fanatic Stadium. Would you like to enter a knockout challenge? I would like to enter. So you to stay with the Pokemon you have in your party now? Yes, I will. Hey, yum yum. Do you think that maybe using Shadow Pokemon here won't be a good idea? Shh. 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 God dang it, Yuki. I hate you so. You want to go for a swim, Yuki? You want to go for a swim? I did see you didn't bring your swim again. We want to go for a swim. I hope there's sharks in these waters. Okay, I got rid of Enza and I got wood. Okay, please enter the stand through the doors to the right or the left side. I'll give you your best effort and go for victory. I'm going to go for the left side because that's the green door. And that's what, that's not better than the blue door. Let's go to the blue door. I can't just walk up to the doors and have them open and walk away. Hey, you ready? Hi, are you part of the job too? I uh, actually can't do uh, Well, we are going to, uh, we're going to battle, and you're going to lose. Like, even if you beat my Pokemon, I'll push you in the water, and then I'm going to hold you down, and you're going to drown. Let's do this! D or not! There we go. Of a knockout challenge, it really pumps me up. Yes, I'm a rich boy. Yes, yes, yes. Also, you know how how this stadium is much less gross than the than the Pyrite Stadium. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Or Py Pyrite Coliseum, whichever. Okay, we got Rim Raid and we got Bandit out. We also have wood in the background, so you know, with wood in the backside. Ah, uh, let's see here. Probably gonna use Bubble Bee on that Centret, and then a quick Strength on that Azuril. Azuril is actually a normal type, so I could have done it to either one, the Bubble Bee to either one. I was thinking Azuril, you know, he would resist the Bubble Bee, but he won't actually because he's he's normal. He's normal type, even though he looks like he's Water type, and all of his evolutions are Water type. He is no okay. That is incredibly bad. We want to do something about that quite immediately. Do any of um. I think Psybeam that um, Remoraid has has a chance of confusing, so that's the only like secondary effect. Like, look at that! That was like an attack from how many levels higher is 40 from 24? Like 16? And it just did one damage. And even if he did resist, it did one damage! Remoraid is so cool! He's so cool! Um, try Psybeam, I think that's a secondary effect. I know that Bubble Beam can slow them. Let me look at all this. Aurora Beam can lower attack. So that's probably better to use on... Centret. So, no! Get the right! Uh, okay, so... Dead. Dead! 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 And that's gonna be a lot of experience, just going straight to Rim Raid. Awesome! I am enjoying that. 141! Oh god, that was not as much experience as I was hoping for. Also, only two Pokemon? Okay! I mean, that's what you want to do, Rich Boy Flits. Oh, his attack fail, that's good. Oh, he's just gonna... Just gonna do that, then. Well, in that case, 
probably best to um, hit him with the ball beam and have Bandit use Helping Hand to help out that ball beam so that it does a lot more damage. Also, have you noticed that Rimuray is faster than both these level 40 Pokemon? Jesus. Jesus, Flitz! You need to raise your Pokemon better! Cock my Rimuray gun at you! Oh! Oh! Oh, it's still, still doing it, huh? Okay. Well, in that case, let's just, uh, side beam quick attack him. And be done. Actually, strength, because first, just faster than him, anyways. Or bandit, sorry. Bandit! It's bandit! Bandit! Ah! Dead. Awesome! That was a lot more experience than the Azoral. <laughs> Oh, I thought the fanfare was fun. I, I got knocked out, chops. Yes, you certainly did, rich boy. Also, just because you're rich, why do you have to have that accent? God dang it, I spilled my coke. Huh? I never seen a guy like you around here for a big guy, but so what? Let's battle. Grab. Sure, Grab. <laughs> Let's battle. Would you like to battle, Grab? Of course you would. Let's have a nice, friendly bout, to Grab. Okay, so it really could go either way for Rimmeraid, because the point of this is really to get a lot Rimmeraid a lot of experience, because he kind of needs it. So, what's what are we gonna do here? Spy Beam would be good against would be good against Tentacle, but Tentacle has really high special defense. The duo has none of that. There's none of that special defense going on. So we're gonna roar beam the duo and uh, pff, strength tentacle. Yeah, yeah, boom! That's a sound that. Whoa, -ho -ho! bandit! Sweet, loving that, loving that. One hit kill, one hit kill. Oh, Ray just soaking up the experience. So wait, what are you doing? Did you learn to follow me? Uh. No. Follow me can be a good strategic move. It makes it so every Pokemon on the field will, at will attack that Pokemon that use follow me, but uh, Bandit doesn't have the defense or the special defense to to handle that kind of thing. Oh, the dude is really fast! Oh, good, he's stupid. That's that's always the best thing to happen. And cock my run raid gun! Bah! Super F. Oh, God. Um. Doop, boop, boop. There we go. Down. Dead. 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 Oh, so close to another level. You got this. You got this, Rim Ray. You got it going on. You got you got the style. Greb. Ah, I got lost. Also, I fell down on my roller skates. I don't know why I walk around in roller skates. It's really an efficient way of traveling. I always fall down and stuff, you know? Although I do get a lot of tips at Sonic. Also, I, just, I really love how this stadium isn't a piece of crap like the other one is. Again, Adele? Why do we always have this battle, Adele? God dang it! Whatever, we got your Pikachu and your Vulpix. Oh no, you changed them for a duck and a pine cone. That was probably an intelligent move on your part. I applaud that. That was my applauding. I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, you can buy it on my album, Yum Yum Applauds the World, starring Yum Yum and, and co-starring uh, Juicy J. I would never associate with a man who chooses to call himself Juicy J, because that's just weird. That's a weird thing to call yourself, Juicy J, who calls himself Juicy J. That's freaking weird. Alright, are we, are we done here yet? Because you guys have been like, what do I do these guys? I was planning on this taking about the whole episode. It's been about 10 minutes. I mean, granted, we still do have two more battles. Okay, don't attack Pineco. Which means everyone attack Pineco with as much strength as you can mu <laughs> As much strength as you can muster. Um. Yeah, I'm using strength a lot because it's Bandit's most powerful move, and he also has same up attack bonus and Silt Scarf. I was thinking about replacing Bandit with Metatite because he has that high jump kick that can just nail things, but I lost him on top, so I lost the Black Belt. So I don't think that can make up for the fact that Bandit has the White Scarf, and, you know, its stats are pretty similar. It doesn't have a side attack, of course, but, you know, 
whichever. All right, Rimray can probably finish him off in the next turn, so we're gonna let him do that. Bandit, use strength on that duck. Strength that duck to death. Break its neck. Oh, it was a critical hit. That would have been useful two turns ago. You know, no, no, no big deal. But you, you could have done that. Level 25 Rim Raid. No new moves. But that's okay, because he's got dang Rim Raid. He already, we can teach him Flamethrower. I mean, come on. It's a fire breathing bitch. I can't get over that. That's the sound Pinko's make when they die. Awesome. So. This has been a plethora of experience. No, it hasn't. It has not been a plethora. Adele, god dang it. I'll have to try harder next time. I wish nothing but the... Whoa, whoa, what the... Whoa, whoa, hold up. This is sound the alarm. Bring, bring, bring. Okay, okay, I gotta gather myself. There'll be a time and a place. Alright, uh, whoa, whoa, that, that accuracy not looking good. Uh, was, mm, but Bubble Beam is better. But Akazuka is a signature move. It can cut accuracy. Ooh, ooh, I said, ooh, ooh, ooh. You got me in the mood. Alright, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna keep Octazooka and get rid of Lock On. If I need Lock On later, I can relearn it, I think. I think there's a relearn in this. Yeah, we'll find out. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Yes! So, yes, we Rimmerade evolved. I forgot that happened then. Doop -a -doop -a -doop -a -doop -a -doop We're just gonna call this the Nay Nay. We're gonna call Rune the Nay Nay. Ha! Cool trainer of Runes and now Ha! And Ha! 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 I'm sorry, I don't understand where that came from, and I just don't really care to know. Okay, what we gonna do here? What we gonna do? What we gonna do? Well, Mudkip. Well, I don't have anything that's good against Mudkip. That's uh, water type. So let's try Octazooka out on Zubat and Bandit. Why don't you use Strength on Mudkip? Actually, actually, let's look at Octillery's new stats. Aw, oh, Jesus, look at that special attack. That's higher than, well, it's not higher than SPS, but it's higher than Mantine's, who is, what, who is, what, how many levels higher than Mantine? 20? No, uh, 20. 11? 11 levels higher, and Mantine's special attack is just slightly higher than Octillery's. Not to mention, his physical attack not bad. J Jesus, also it's better than... God dang it, Pendix. <laughs> I love you because you fall behind, Pendix. Don't don't worry about it. Oh, okay, well, whatever. doop a doop boop boop boo doop Alright, let's see how this plays out. Let's see how Squirt does, flying Zulu. Well, that that thing almost died. I mean, came out. Oh, yep, 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 Sorry about that. I just up! Now, it's not any more powerful than Mobile Beam, but it does lower their accuracy, which can be cool because that leech life is going to get just slightly annoying. Also, I probably should have just used Aurora Beam because, you know. Uh, strength on the Mudkip. I mean, why use Quick Attack when Bandit always just goes first, anyways? I don't think it makes sense because Bandit's really staying fast, and I love him for that. So, that's that's good. Oh, we got, we got, oh my god, breaking ground here. He's got a third Pokemon. Ho, 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 Octazooka, Octazooka for the win. Roar, beep. Oh, he still cocks his nose. He, 
He cocked his nose where his room raid cocked his entire body. This is amazing. I love this octopus. You can... <laughs> Let's try from this moment on. Because I just thought of one. To not use any hentai jokes for oct for artillery for this entire playthrough, let's never once mention hentai for artillery. That's gonna be my goal to never stoop to that level. Okay, making a pact right now. Also, we won. Music. There we go. Ah! Ha! 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 <laughs> Congratulations, you're the champion. Your battles were fantastic. Your victory means you have won 5,912 cash prize and a team 18. Team 18, I believe, is Rain Dance or Sunny Day, one of the two. Yeah, it's Rain Dance. At this, you can play this for four rounds. You can get Rain Dance, Sunny Day, Giga Drain, and then Solar Beam. So if those are appealing to you, if you're training a Bayleaf, I had a Bayleaf, but I uh, kind of left it to die in the box. But if you are training a Bayleaf, this is a fantastic place to come. doesn't really take a lot of effort. The levels are still in the 40s. It's the lowest level training, the lowest level stadium there is in the game. So be happy for stuff. Push! Alright, where are we doing on time? Doop 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 doop. Not quite 20 minutes yet. We can make it a little shorter. We could do that. Now, now hear me out here. We could do that. Or. We could go fight Wally. Wanna go fight Wally? Let's go fight Wally! That's not his name, is it? God, what's his name? Wally's the guy from Emerald. Who is. Who is this guy? Wallace? No. Willie! Willie! I know I started with a W! But yeah, you're tough. You're not in the mood. Mood. Come on in the mood. Mood. Sleep in with a friend. What? Don't you want to battle? Okay. Kale then! Hey, yo, buddy. I got a bone to pick with you. Yeah, I'm feeling chipper. Let's do this, Rogue Kale. He will battle you after you defeat Dakim, as will most of the trainers in this town. In fact, all the trainers in this town will fight you again after you beat Dakim. So that's good. Oh! They're level 40s. Good, and I have Pendix outs. Good. Pendix, you're just... I love you, buddy. And I know once you evolve, you'll be a more defensive defensive tank, which is what I'm hoping for. But you first, you gotta evolve... And that means you gotta stop dying. Oh, wait, what's his ability slash your caps? What does that do? Firmly, okay. Good. <laughs> that's, that's a detailed description right there if I've ever seen one. Okay. So, what are we gonna do about this? Um, Octazuka Corellia. That's probably gonna be the worst thing that's gonna be happening. And then Sunny Day. Oh, no! Oh, no! Oh no! Pendix, come on, man. Oh, oh Pendix. <laughs> we could send out wood. Should we send out wood? No, we're not gonna send out wood. Let's send out Espeon. See what he can do about this kind of madness. Espeon is currently my lowest level. No, he's not my lowest level. That would be artillery. Because I just tried. Jesus! Were you trying to rape Pendix? <laughs> Okay, I was hoping to revive also Octazuka Mist, so that's a downside to Octazuka. Oh, uh, god dang it. This is a pickle. I'm thinking I'm going to use Revive on Pendix because he was just, just short of getting another level. And once he gets to level 38, woo mama, he'll beat him with cargo and then, you know, stuff, stuff going to be happening. So let's use Reflect because that Gramble is screwing our crap up. And hopefully that will mean the Grandpa won't immediately kill us, just the Corellia will, you know, it's just that. So I'm pretty sure Espeon and, and Octillery are going down this turn, but that's okay. Because they will return stronger than they ever have been before. But so don't be anti! Hi, I'm anti! You want to be my best friend? Hi, I'm anti! Mantine! Stop telling people your name, Mantine! Mantine, though! I'm Mantine! Yes, Mantine, we know! It's 
It's in your little description box. You only gotta tell them all the time. You know, bro? You used to be a little discreet sometimes, but I'm on time. Yes, yes, you are. And we'll never forget that. This is quite a pickle. Uh, uh, okay. That. Do what that is. Pendix didn't use Sunny Day, did he? No, he didn't. Okay. Boom! Oh, that did not enough damage. Uh oh. Here we go. Octazooka. Octazooka. And that will lower its accuracy, which means it will stop decimating everybody with Psychic. That's good. That's good. We're making progress. We're making bank. We're getting money, getting paid. Uh. Bubble Beam. Grand Bull. Bubble Beam. G Grand Bull. No. Wait. 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 Yeah, Grample. Double bubble. Double bubble beam. Yay! More bubbles! Yes, Manti. And lots and lots of bubbles. Do you like the bubbles? Yeah, I like the bubbles. I'm so happy for you. No! You're supposed to miss? You're supposed to miss? Oh, Manti. No! Manti, he was so jolly. Oh, no. Oh, Fendix. Oh, no. <laughs> This is bad. This is bad. We're doing bad. Oh god, with the with the strength Oh no Oh no Come on Noctillery, do something, do something about this. We're a bunch of incompetent fools. There we go Oh god dang it Magic of the quick attack Boom Oh god his jaw slapped him in the face Oh that there we go. That's perfect. Oh, artillery! Yay, Pendix! I'm so incredibly happy for you, Pendix. Uh, then death. Wait, Pendix can kill that! Ah, oh, artillery is level 26. That was fast. Because, you know, we're fighting things ridiculously past our level. Oh. Wait, artillery could kill that. Okay, he's using... Good, he's stupid. Um, he's using growth. I did, in fact, use a potion... On all of this is bad. I did in fact use a potion on Bandit because that seemed like the smart thing to do. Uh, Psybeam and then uh, Strength. Come on, don't fail me now. Oh bad, 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 no, Bandit, no! No! Bandit, no! Well, that's bad. That is bad. That is super bad. But you know what? Endure and survive. We have Pendix. The hero of tomorrow. That is the face of the hero of tomorrow. Go on, Tiller, you got this. You don't got this. This is bad. This is so incredibly bad. Okay. What we're going to hope for is that we're going to hope Nuzleaf continues to be stupid. And we're going to use a flamethrower. Oh, he wasn't. He didn't continue to be stupid. And then... WHY CAN PENDIX NOT LIVE?! LET HIM LIVE, DARN IT! Oh, God. Penix, I love you, buddy, but I'm, for God's sake, I'm sending out wood. You've made me send out wood. I don't even like wood. Just kind of dances to- and then, and then my choke went on the ground. This is becoming increasingly incredibly bad. Uh, <laughs> uh, God, uh, low kick? Nuzleaf is part dark type, so maybe a low kick would be good. No, stop, 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 stop! Ah, oh, God, God, no, 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 Okay, good, okay. He's, he's got the defenses of a champ. We got this. Oh, I think we won. I think we won. Boom. Nuzleaf down, because low kick. And then, notice how Wood just contributed more than, than Pendix. This was a mistake. I wish I hadn't have done this. Uh, <laughs> oh no! Oh, oh yeah, citrus berry. That was that was smart. I kill you. That was a good call. Uh, side beam and rock, rock slide. He's using submission. That's that's bad. Uh, looks like all of this is going to wait. <laughs> Artillery one. Artillery one without without dying. Oh god, I just got beat down to nothing but an octopus. Let's, let's address that for a minute. Ah, this was supposed to be a fun bout. That was so bad. That was so bad. 
Hope you enjoyed this episode of Yum Yum Plays Pokemon Coliseum. This foreboding episode. Don't moan at me. That's gross to talk about your full body experiences. I don't roll that way. If you enjoyed, you know what to do. There's a lot of buttons. You could click all of them. Click all of them a bunch of times. Especially the little thumbs up one. And also, if you haven't clicked that one that has a little air on it, yeah, you can do that. We can do that stuff for you, you know? I'm going to kick this old man and take my anger out of him. I'm sorry, I shouldn't do that. I'll just look at this gear. It's just junk. Stick and gear, get your life together.